5 minutes to choose the best Jamorji book for your audible. I recommend this book, the book number 184, Internal World of Gemstone by Lublin. This book published in 1983, 40 years ago. 234 page talk about inclusion in gemstone and diamond and then also synthetic gemstone so very important book and then this is what I have inside right now here yeah, the contents the first one talk about introduction the second one genetic and the third part diagnostic and the uh, Third and the fourth, the last one talk about synthetic inclusion. So you can know everything inside this book. So here, introduction, for example, the internal life of gemstone. The beauty of gemstone inclusion, value and significance of gemstone inclusion from ancient Rome to the electron microprobe. The investigation of gemstone inclusion and then gemstone in spare and time. In space and time. And then what are the inclusion in gemstone? Genetic classification inclusion. Genesis natural and important of inclusion. Proto-genetic inclusion. Syngenetic inclusion, syngenetic mineral inclusion, synthetic genetic liquid inclusion, primary cavity inclusion in uh, crystal, the filling material of cavity, and then aggregate state in crystal cavity secondary syngenetic inclusion. So everything is about genetic in here in this part. Gas inclusion, twinning and sonal binding. A star stone. So like that, and then the next part talk about diamond and its mineral sibling, and then precious corundum ruby and sapphire inclusion, depth of mountain lake inclusion, the moisset relative of emerald, and first part with centiplate and twin. Okay, so this part diagnostic inclusion of individual inclusion in uh, gemstone. So if you see some inclusion like this try to explain to you something like that so you can make sure that one it come from come from for example centiplate if you see a centiplate um characteristic so that means feldspar okay and then garnet show you some uh, variety and inclusion picture lotus leaf in peridot quartetia Trough and rare inclusion and mini spinel in spinel, non miscible liquid into pass and hair fry capillary in tourmaline, gestatum destroy, silicon and uh, silicon uh, crystal. The, the the last part talk about uh, synthetic, okay, everything synthetic like corundum, emerald, spinel, rutai, titanate and yttrium aluminate and then glass also so so detail and then you can see a lot of information okay the first part okay some something like that so we show you for example so the beginning here inclusion in the gemstone, they also have the um, description down. And this one show you what? Twinning and sonal binding in corundum. So you can see something like it also in corundum and then this part tell you about um, everything what uh, how to make like this how to go like this okay and next many things in details and star stone okay what you can see you can see like um this characteristic why is half star because uh, you can see root tie have 
the um, orientation like this like and then happened star now this picture show you um hair fine needle or fruit tie in sapphire okay and then uh, if you see star like uh, yet it's just from hexagonal same the um, crystal structure and after that you can see the star in um, ruby sapphire like that and here many inclusion important you can understand and clear in this book we got a very big book and then so in detail very really good until now even 40 years but it's still very good you can understand in this so this one very beautiful then did the formation of skeleton crystal of manganese oxide as seen with uh, the naked eye in what mosquito agate in muscat agate okay you can see it in here natural inclusion is so beautiful something like this and then diamond also here inclusion in diamond this part okay and then what you can see okay you can see some inclusion what red thing is like is um what unusual family portrait of a uh, diamond twin border in brilliant cut diamond colorless olivine and red garnet and the uh, green dioxide okay you can see some red some green in this picture so yes in um, crystal inclusion in diamond wow this one so beautiful nice crystal inclusion maybe garnet okay so you can study in this book tell you everything so again this one burma ruby with very occurring liquid feather of unusual pattern okay you can see some inclusion like this from burma that is an inclusion in ruby uh, ruby ah let's skip to emerald uh, you can see some um, for example this she wore my in Colombia with a well developed and you hit crystal of of a pyrite and uh, you can see pyrite in what emerald also wow this one another one right hand emerald from muso classified classified by um it's a calcite you see calcite in emerald too so interesting so they collect every inclusion that important that you can identify what stone okay what stone that you want to find out so this one for example centiplate if you found like this so yeah you cannot guess with another thing so it will be what first part or moonstone okay the part like this is a moonstone and this one like um what hostel top on top this one in dematoid if you see like this yes you have to say what in dematoid and it because some inclusion is just specific if you found yes you, you can just know quickly and uh, this one the last one i will show you for example this one a lotus what um what is called on the bottom this one inclusion in peridot is a glass from glass inclusion or called lotus leaf in peridot okay you can find like that so you can know this one Yes, hurry up. Okay, hope you enjoyed the whole book. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you tomorrow. Oh, don't forget this one. Uh, synthetic inclusion too. If you follow this, yes, the, you cannot see in what? In natural. You have to say from synthetic, some synthetic. Okay, this one. Um, synthetic ruby. You can see it's, uh, inclusion like this. When you zoom, and then you can read, understand easy with many pictures, clear. Everything, every strand, 
like this inclusion yeah it's from synthetic okay thank you so much for watching and i will see you tomorrow